Last week's Pasha ended with the birth of Rivka, our ancestral mother, our matriarch, Rivka. This week's Pasha starts with the death of Sora, the first of our mothers, of our matriarchs. The death of the one and the birth of the other was at the same time. About this the sages say that the sun rises and the sun sets. That the sun of one great person does not set until the new sun of another great person rises. The one had come into the world to take the place of the other. And this is because Hashem doesn't leave us without great people. He brings great people into our lives to serve as an example of how to live and to be a source of inspiration and encouragement for us. And these are great people. They lived lives that were full. They were able to fill their lives every day and every moment of their lives had significance, had importance. It was rich. Their lives were great lives. And great doesn't mean necessarily famous or in the public arena. Great means quality, a quality internal life. The life within, the life of the person, the joy that he experiences, the love that he has for other people, and the respect he has for other people, and the fact that he, can, he shares in them, in their joys and their sorrows. He connects with upper worlds and lower worlds. This is the quality of life that makes for great people. And Hashem doesn't abandon us without a great person in our midst to guide us and help us. The message for us, though, is that we too can subscribe to this greatness. We too can be great as such people are great. We too can fill, can live, fulfill and live important, significant lives. We have the example and it's for us to follow this example. It's for us to empower ourselves that our lives too are filled with joy and with love and with respect for others. This is something that's totally available for us. And a final message is this. Even though Hashem is the source of all power, this does not stop Him from empowering us as well, from sharing in this quality. And therefore we too, as we look to empower ourselves, we should also look, and this is really part of empowering ourselves, we should also look to empower others. We should make sure that our sun continues to rise and that we help others also, that they too should be rising suns.